I am a Sakanaya student here at the Astor Place Wegmans. I'm happy to be a part of the East Village community, hanging out with you guys. Been here, what, three weeks now almost, and it's been pretty fun. So, I'm joined today by Sato-san and some people from the seafood office, and we're going to be breaking down this beautiful tuna for you guys. But once again, I just want to say thank you, everybody, for being here. How many people knew about the show before they got here? A lot of people. How many people were just here for grocery shopping and then saw a tuna? I love, all right, I love that, I love that, right? Where else are you going to go and bump into a tuna like this? have a 104-ish pound MSC certified bluefin tuna. This tuna was caught just for us off the coast of Spain, uh, right outside of Gibraltar. What's important about MSC, Marine Stewardship Council, is this tuna was sustainably caught. The waters that we pulled this fish out of, out off the coast of Spain, can handle us fishing there. The tuna population in that area is healthy and it's, it's about Sakanaya. Over here we have our Toyosu tables, right? This is what we fly in from Japan overnight. We get everything on Tuesday mornings and we get everything on Friday mornings. And that stuff comes from Toyosu Market to JFK to our door. It does not do a layover in Topeka. It does not go to Canada and wait in a warehouse for a little bit. It comes right to us. Never frozen and that's really special. That's really exciting. We partner with Wariki, who has a long, long, long standing tradition of really great seafood. So they're teaching us and right? Alright, let's do it! We cut the tuna and we're going to expose the ribs and we're going to scrape the meat between the ribs. This is called nakaochi. Way around, all the way around, so please be patient. But Sato-san is starting with the head. And he makes it look really easy. I, I'm practicing, I'm training how to do this. Um, and it is not, it, it's definitely, a, it's a marathon. Hi! Oh, the top of the head, there's also meat around the back of it. Um, and then you got cheek meat as well, which is really exciting. So we're gonna be, that head is actually already spoken for. Somebody called ahead already and said, hey, I want everything off of that. And then we have collar, come on. Beautiful, right? So you see how light the meat is right here? That's like, when you think about like Wagyu steak, or like it's gonna start to taste like what the fish eats, in a good way. Really exciting. Are the collar spoken to we have one collar up for grabs. So Sato-san is using his knife to follow the and that, with his knife to be able to get the best part of that loin off. A lot of times with the larger tuna you'll see them use the katana, the katana to cut all the way down, the really long sword. The soy sauce, we're gonna pass that around for everybody to try. So be patient with us, there will be enough samples for everybody. Yeah, I was wondering if I could have the Jabara. Jabara. Yeah. 